So in today's video, we're going to be trying to make a Python script that plays Roblox spelling before us. And although this probably does count as hacking, um, I'm kind of only doing this as like a Python project, so yeah, please don't ban me. So my plan going into this is to first record Roblox's output audio, transcribe it into text, then type it out, all using the Python script. By the way, if you want to try working on your Python skills and learning something new yourself, please feel free to click the button on the top right corner of the screen, or check out my video that I put in the pinned comment in the description, where I basically show you guys how to make this project yourself, explaining the code behind it the best I can. But yeah, let's get right into it. So obviously our first step is going to be recording our desktop audio. So it looks like we have something here, and to test this, I'm just going to play my own video. Hello everyone, in today's video, I'm going to be showing you how to make a plane game, where when you hover over land, you cast a shadow, and you, when you hover over water. So yeah, let's see if that worked. Where, when you hover over land, yep, that worked. you cast a shadow, and you... So now we basically have the code to record small part of our desktop audio which basically we're going to be doing in Roblox because it just records the whole computer's output audio and well Roblox can be one of them so yeah on to the next step. Okay so I just made something and now it's time to put it to the test. Um, it wasn't because, uh, you can make it slow become more difficult slower if you want to and also you can add upgrades so that the plane can shoot more bullets after something um, yeah there we go i think i said those words there in the video so now all we need to do is just get the last word of the sentence and then make the program type it up because in the game when it says something like please spell and then the word it's uh, we don't need to type out please this please spell part so yeah, we just need to get the last word of this and make the program type it out, and we should be done. Well, after some hours of trial and error, I think I have a final product. I'm just going to check it one last time with a random hard word on Google. Enigmatic. And yep, you can even press enter for me. Yep, time to use this on Roblox Spelling Bee. Well, it seems like Roblox Spelling Bee actually has multiple versions, and the one that most people talk about isn't actually the most popular one. So yeah, after we try this one, let's just try the other one that looks kind of sketchy over there. But yeah, I think the, the better one is probably this one, which is surprisingly less popular. So we're gonna see how far we can get on the difficulty list with this, and I actually think it might be do better in the more difficult ones because it gives you more time to answer the word. Okay, a new round just started, and I am the bacon man over here because I'm not gonna use my main account for this. Oh wow, okay, that it just answered the thing. Can you spell? So yeah, let's see if we can actually win this game. It is a beginner round, so I think it shouldn't be too hard, but also, I feel like the words, it gives you less time to answer the words as you get a streak, so it might actually be harder to win a round in beginner than just do it yourself without the hacks. Okay, I got lucky they accept homophones there. Please spell foot. Okay, why didn't they say the word there? Yeah, I think I could have won that if it wasn't for that. Maybe that's meant to stop people from cheating, but I don't know. Yeah, you know, the, I think the reason we lost is because it was way too easy. So let's move on to something more difficult.
Oh, this one's kind of weird. I'm not sure if it's. Oh, never mind. You just got the it pretty word easily. Is the word is paradox. Wait. Bruh. Yeah, after you get a Lord streak, you get really less time, so I think this hack is only useful in the advanced servers where you actually get time to type out the word. So yeah, let's go to the next level. Yeah, we're skipping moderate and going straight to advanced. Steadfast. Okay, one more to go. Can you spell fruition? Exorcism. Yep, there we have it. I just want a game if it's that spelling be without actually spelling any of the words. Yeah, let's do one more of that. Spell Chargaga Dog Man Chaga Dog Child come on. Yeah. Okay, the, the game just started trolling this guy with some random made up words, so yeah. I think that's GG's. Huh? Uh... Spell... Okay, what? Negotiation. Dude, what am I even supposed to type on Google to find out what that is? Yep, GG's again. I think that's a two win streak now. Okay, I think it's time to move on to expert now. Spell martyrdom. Okay, wow, these words are hard. Yeah, reasonable crash out. All right, spell oh no, it's our turn. Yep, nothing our program Next can't up, handle. Ambidextrous. Wow, okay. GG's. Isthmus. Okay, I only had to spell one word there. Acophony. Okay, GG's again. Aegis. It's time to move on to something even more difficult. Let's go straight to genius. Okay, wow, these guys are not messing around. Next up, Quindicasyllabic. Oh, what? It's my turn. Wait, I'm gonna have to do this myself. Uh... Okay, wow, I, I didn't expect to get that right. Alright, can you spell thermochromatography? Wait, no, no, no. Oh, my program read it as thermal astrography. Okay, looks like this guy is kind of catching on. Actually, I'm gonna, I'm gonna turn off my humanizing code and make it so that it just immediately types the answer to make it even more obvious that I'm hacking. I'm just gonna see if I can get banned. Oh, well, it seems like the problem is it keeps separating long words into two words, so. It never gets it right because it only types out the last word. Now, does this program work in the hardest spelling bee difficulty that there is? That's your job to figure out. If you are interested in making this yourself on Python, please strongly consider following along my tutorial video where I will be explaining the code behind this. But for now, let's try to get banned on this. Oh wow, I didn't even have to type a word to win this game. That's just how difficult this mode is. Hypercholesterolemia. Yeah, I think I'm gonna drop down a level or two and try to Xylotype get banned there instead. Spell 
articulate. Next up, forthcoming. Okay, <laughs> seems like they finally got me. Well, let's move on to the other surprisingly more popular Roblox spell and begin. Okay, what is that? Okay, so it looks like in this game there's grades and every time you get a word correct, you move up a grade and as you move up a grade, the words get harder. So yeah, our goal is going to be using this program to pass 12th grade, I guess. Ink. Own. Cow. Spell. Truck. Curb. Well, I'm kind of like the only person who passed like fourth or fifth grade, so everyone probably thinks I'm really cool Swallow. for coming this far. I think most people who play this game are just like probably not that good at English. Their English is probably like their second Please language, spell. so yeah. I think that's Banana. why this game might be a bit more popular than the other one. But yeah, we made it to ninth grade. These words are pretty easy though. Considered. Exaggerate. Okay, where did where did the here the D? There's <laughs> that was the last grade as well. Okay, I have to play this again. There's no way I'm leaving with failing grade twelve. Ventriloquism. Okay, this one's kind of hard. Please spell. Essentially. What? Why is hers so much easier? Okay, I gotta beat here now. A pertinence. Okay, yeah, that, this is hard. I mean, it is grade twelve, so yeah. Please. Spell. Okay, please get this wrong. Indomitable. Yeah, she's not getting this right. Yup. GG's. Okay, I can't tell. Please get it wrong. Yep. Seems like that's GG's. And no, I do not want to add it to my favorites, but I do like the A star. So yeah, I just passed grade 12. And if you also want to pass grade 12, please watch my video on how to make this. And please, if you enjoy this, please leave a like and subscribe. And also let me know in the comments if you'd like more of this because this isn't the usual type of content I make. So yeah, I'll see you in the next video.